there everybody, my name is Curse Shadogs to Bob 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 Theme Park News and welcome to a Theme Park Newsroom Halloween update. This is from Farmageddon, Lancashire's big scare attraction and this on a brand new May set to come. A brand new scare house has been advertised on the website for 2020, known as the Uprising. So before we get started, make sure you like, comment, subscribe and the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. And for now guys, let's get into this video. Make sure you get your questions in for the Q&A using the hashtag question before or after your question in the comments as well. So, Farmageddon in Lancashire uh, has four scare house attractions, uh, or scare attractions, so we say we've got Zombie Outlaw Paintball, uh, then you've also got the Meat House, uh, which is like your, your butchery, uh, slaughterhouse themed house, uh, you've got Contagion, which is your clown theme, uh, you've got the Beast of Terror, uh, which had an extension on it until 2019. Of course, that didn't have the extension, which has apparently been removed, uh, known as the Foundry, but the main mode is called the Beast of Terror. And then they've got this brand new scare house coming to the uh, attraction for 2020 that's been announced on the website, and that is the Uprising. So we're going to be telling you all the details on this. Uh, Farmageddon is a good-looking Halloween event. I'd like to potentially attend this event uh, in the future. Uh, but for now, let's have a look at the um, sort of details about this new scare house. So, according to the Farmageddon website, Farmageddon proudly presents the uprising. For the past seven years, decades in underground mil militia, for the past seven decades, an underground militia uh, uh, or militia has been gathering its res reserves to strive once again for world domination and to create a superhuman race. Your mission is to stop this at all costs. Immoral scientists are using evolution against us. Do you have what it takes to lead the resistance? Through laboratories and via inhumane militant training methods, evil is manufactured on an awesome scale. Can you avoid capture? Will you make it through training and join the resistance? And the time will tell, however time is running out. Tick tock, tick tock. Uh, now I'm going to put uh, a link to where you can buy tickets for Farmageddon. Uh, or a link to the website if you want to look at more uh, in the description down below. I'm not too sure if they have put tickets on sale yet. I think they might have, but I'm not too sure. I can't confirm that at this stage. Uh, but you can have a look at the website that I'll put in the description down below. So, my thoughts then on the uprising. What does it sound like to me? Well, I think this sounds like uh, a very nice uh, military, inhuman experiment gone wrong type maze. I think we've really got something good going on here. There's a real potential for big squeezers. If you haven't seen it, please go and watch my uh, maze POV of the singularity at York Maze Howler Scream and you'll notice um, you know, one of them going down, uh, where it's like a massive cushion. You sort of get squeezed in the middle of these two big cushions, sort of pressing you together. Uh, and it's a way of traveling from room to room. So uh, it's a real it's a real good opportunity to do that. There's a real good opportunity for a couple of tunnel sections, maybe. Um, there's a good opportunity for some lab scares, some good jump scares as well, and maybe some uh, inhuman soldiers getting uh, experimented on. Trying to, make, trying to create the superhuman army, maybe. So they make, might jump scary throughout the lab. Maybe doctors becoming superhuman, experiments going wrong, uh, jump scaring you as well. So there's real potential here for a really good extreme scare house. Uh, now, we're not too sure on the scare difficult, like the scare rating as of yet. Uh, however, it's really getting us excited. You know, we're, we're not even... Like, we're nearly in March. Um, and the fact that we are... You know, we're getting this um, sort of scare news already um, is absolutely brilliant. So I really love the fact of what they're doing with this. So um, my thoughts overall, I think it's a good extreme scare maze, a good scare house, a good new scare house for 2020. And I think Farmageddon are going to do a really good job with this. I've seen the work they've done in past new houses in the past. Uh, obviously the four sort of main scare attractions, Contagion, of course, used to be known as Contagion 3D. Uh, and of course, it looks like from the website, the 3D element has gone off. Uh, the Beast of Terror, which used to have the old Foundry extension. Uh, and of course, uh, you've also got the Meat Locker. And you've also got the Zombie Outlaw Paintball attraction as well. Uh, so it had a good range of attractions, but... Uh, this is the fourth scare house. This is the, this is the fourth scare house to join Meat Locker, Contagion, and the Beast of Terror. So I think the Uprising is a good addition uh, to Farmageddon's scare lineup, and of course, 
you know, this is going to be a, a good, good scare attraction uh, with some plenty, plenty of creative opportunities with this as well. So uh, make sure you share your thoughts in the comments down below. Uh, and for now, guys, thank you very, very much for watching this Halloween update from Farmageddon. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you never miss a future video. And for now, guys, keep it on the coast life, and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care. Have an awesome day.